Hello, I'm Deborah Lee, and I'm going to teach you how to do soothing rhythm breathing. So let's start first with our position and posture. So find a comfy position, depending on your aches and pains and your mobility. I'm sitting upright on my sofa. My back is against the cushion, and I'm just gently lifting my torso up and out of my sitting position. And I'm going to lift my shoulders up to my ears and roll them down my back to open up my chest. Give my lungs all the space they need to breathe. Next, we're going to breathe in and out through our nose. So I want you to pay attention to what it feels like to breathe in and out through your nose. I'm going to place my hands on top of my belly, just below my sternum, where my diaphragm is roughly located. So sometimes we call this belly breathing. So when I breathe in and out, I notice that my belly lifts my hands away from my body and then deflates. So just notice that now as you breathe in and out. I just gently slow this down. So really breathe in until your lungs feel full and then breathe out until your lungs feel empty. And actually when you breathe out through your nose, you might notice a sort of a feeling like a vibration in your throat, as if you're sort of beginning to snore. That's a good sign. That really helps us notice our out breath and bring it into our diaphragm. So in and out through our nose and see if we can feel the breath expanding and contracting our diaphragm by the way our belly feels like it's being pushed out and then deflating. So just as you're settling into this breathing practice, just relax into the smooth ebb and flow of breath in and out, just like that gentle ebb and flow. Imagine the sea, the tide coming in on the sand, gently in and then just gently out. Just notice that smoothness as you breathe now. In through your nose, out through your nose. And now let's bring in rhythm. What we mean by rhythm is that we have a set pattern for each breath cycle. So sometimes people find it helpful to count in, maybe say for five seconds in and then five seconds out. Five seconds in and five seconds out. So when you're learning to breathe in this way, it can be quite helpful to count at first, just to get you used to the rhythm of breathing. And it's not something that's just going to come immediately. You need to practice it. So just be gentle with yourselves and just play around with a rhythm of breath that you find comforting and soothing. So now we've got the position of our breath in our diaphragm, which we can really encourage by placing our hands on the top of our belly. Don't forget our shoulders back. Now we're breathing in and out through our nose. Feeling our breath in the centre of our body and our core. Noticing that vibration as we push the breath out through our nose and down our body. And finding our rhythm, a rhythm that works for each breath cycle. 
smooth, rhythmical breathing, centered on our diaphragm, smooth and rhythmical. So see if you can practice that every day. Find a little space in your day to just practice a technique of soothing rhythm breathing, but then just pepper it throughout your day. So see if you can become aware of your breathing. And every time you notice your attention in your breath, just gently practice the technique. And just one little last comment. Sometimes when we begin to do breathing practice, we can actually start to feel a little bit more agitated and anxious, and, you know, I can't breathe and I can't get up. Just gently stay with that and bring your attention back into your breath. It's really common that somehow we get a little bit more anxious when we start to focus on our breath. So just bring your attention back into your body and just stay with that. Get out of your mind if you can and into your body. And with practice, you will gently work through that wall of anxiousness. And there we'll find a field of equanimity when you are really leaning into your breath. Being really present in the moment with breath. And that experience is like a little power nap. It's rejuvenating to your, to your mind and your body. So I hope you can feel the benefit of that and good luck with your practice.